how to create momentum for the new year. Welcome to this short video. Depending on when you watch it, if it's still January or maybe February, it is still valid. You can always say create momentum for the time coming. Of course, the start of the year is a perfect time for doing this because we have somehow ingrained in our mind that this is a, like, a, like, a, like a milestone that we um, achieved and now the new year is starting on a blank sheet of paper. What is not true? But anyway, it's a good um, starting point. So how can you get the best out of that? And I'm going to give you some ideas and maybe reminders that many of us have forgotten over the last time. And, um, and as well here, uh, much of that stuff we might know and have heard of, but are we really acting on it? And I want to just strengthen three key aspects, not more, um, three key aspects that I, in my experience when I'm working with top leaders, uh, sometimes really get forgotten. They are really um, always, uh, as soon as the craziness of the daily job starts again and kicked in, and for sure that did already happen, um, we forget about these things. I just want to remind you, number one, highest ambition. You can achieve at least twice as much in, in this year than in the last year. It's not easy. It's not just coming by that. And I'm not saying that I know exactly how you can do that in your situation. I'm just stating it's possible. It's thinkable because you find always somebody who does it. And uh, this mindset is very, very important to understand. So if you have something that you want to achieve, uh, it could be some idea that you just put on 50% or even 100% and say, I can do more. Is there a guarantee that you will achieve it? Of course not. <laughs> Never is. The chances are very high if you put in uh, the bar a bit higher that you put in the subconscious effort as well to do this and to watch towards that and end up better than if you had ended up without this goal. So I can just stress that I see that over and over again, raise your ambition level. You can do more. And uh, there's just some things that are holding you back and mainly 95%, I would guess, it's our past that's holding us back. It's our experience that we have. They say, okay, in the past it didn't work. Or when it worked, it was just by chance. And all these stories we tell ourselves, that's the main obstacle we have. So the key is, that you really say, no, I don't believe in these obstacles. I can do more. And there's proof that always somebody in this world um, made it happen. And if not even, you could be the first one, right? It's always possible. It's always possible to so be more ambitious. Number two, of course, you need to have a strong plan. And this is, it sounds so simple. I know, I know. You know that you need to plan. <laughs> However, if it comes to your goals that you really want to do, uh, what are you doing this month, next month, the month after? Maybe you have that. I see again, the majority of even top leaders don't have that so much laid out. So you could put 12 boxes on a sheet of paper for each month. You say, okay, what is the key result that I get in this month? And um, not just the one number. If you're on sales, for example, it could be a sales number. If you have that, um, uh, even that not everybody has. But also other things, personal development or whatever it is. I say, really, in my ambition, I need to grow. I need to make this happen here and there. So have a very strong plan. And then, of course, the third one is massive execution. And there it falls flat normally. As I say, okay, I have these plans. Uh, I have the great ambition. I have the plans. And I say, okay, now the daily craziness starts and all the urgent stuff gets before the, impor the important one. And um, this, I can just say, you need to take, you need to create a massive momentum and immediately going there. And I do this, I do this, I do this, no matter what. I know that sounds simpler than it is at the end of the day in the execution. It's simple, but not easy. Uh, I know this pretty well, but as a reminder, you can do more and achieve more. And this is my calling here in this video. Just don't settle for the mediocre, settle for more, get for more, strive for more for the achievement. And you can then do that. And chances are that you will increase your success massively in this year. Okay, so I hope that helps. If you like this, then please forward this video. Also share your comments and hit the like button. And I'm looking forward to seeing you in one of my next videos. Take care.